So this is the upper section that I've been working on for my little off-road park in my backyard. As we come this way, we get to the start-finish line. I'll turn around and show you that in a moment. As you can see, it's a jump. Uh, the cars would be facing me right there. You see the uh, area for going in reverse to go back up the hill here. Over here, we've built in some scale trail. I do plan on covering those with some dirt. It comes around here. It's a bit bermed here so we can do some higher speeds around this tree or we can do some scale runs. It's a lot of uh, filthy, filthy terrain through here and we come up this way. If we want to do a little higher speeds there's a jump right there otherwise it's more of a little uh, just articulation obstacle. Coming around here is the big drift corner or should you desire the jump that wraps right back around to the start finish line. Now here's going to be our little fire pit and that huge guy is a snail shell I found during all of this. Look at that. Look at that. That thing is massive. So he, he's getting kept of course. Now The less track, more scale. Here we go. There's the trail coming down. But before I go into there, let me show you this. Dun dun. My climbing rocks. Yeah, I found that bottle. I figure I'm going to put it somewhere in this little display and call that Hammered Hill. So, anyhow. Coming back to the trail, coming through here, you'll notice a bunch of branches I can move around. There's a rock right, right there that I can move around. My teaser video was going through here. There's actually a trail that way and a trail that way. And they actually come out in two different areas. So um, that's it for the main section. Let me uh, get another... Uh, or let me pause this rather and uh, we'll uh, get back to the other side so I can continue the rest of this course.